He is not, and Tatis drives one to deep left field. He drives one to the moon. High, deep, and very gone. Fernando Tatis Jr. with a two-run shot as the Padres on the board. Tatis crushes his fourth home run of the year. 0-2, Fernando. High fly ball. Cut. Rushed. Deep left field. Ball going, ball gone. How's his adjustment right there? Pretty good? Yes, he's adjusting, and this lead has been cut in half. Fernando stood right at home plate. He absolutely knew down to his spleen that he'd gotten all of that. Again, see if he goes again, not this time. That is lifted in the air to deep left field. He admires it. It is a two-run home run for Tatis. Way gone. And he just pads those numbers. Boy. Wow. That's mucho cuidado right there. Think he knew he got it? Oh. Oh. The left fielder, Taylor, didn't even move. That is one of the hardest hit balls we have seen hit in a very long time, and it went way out of here. It rattled around underneath the video board and left. Here's Tatis Jr. has been getting games started off with a bang here for the Padres. In the air to deep left field. He started another game with another leadoff home run. Bottom of the first inning, takes it out of the yard, his sixth home run of the year for Fernando Tatis Jr., who does it again. Good way to start every ball game. Kid, you are unbelievable. This kid's like a, a PlayStation character. MLB player, hitting home runs, leading off, and doing the dance. It's, it's incredible. He's <laughs> pretty sure he had it. Yeah. Home run to lead it off in the first inning. Single to center in the third. High drive, deep left field for Tatis. Not one, but two home runs. Out of the yard for Tatis. Brings the Padres within a run. Seventh home run of the year for Fernando Tatis Jr., who will touch them all. Not many mistakes get by the kid. Well, I asked for a bloop and a blast. That is the blast, still trailing by one. Oh, I can get used to seeing that dance quite a bit as well in that Padre dugout. It's a high four seamer. Watch him get to it. Middle in, hands are in, sends it on his way. The kid's unbelievable. So fun to watch. Drives this one to deep left center field. Back goes Marte. What a start for the Padres. Fernando Tatis Jr. goes deep. Home run number five of the year. With one swing of the bat, the Padres take a 1-0 lead. That's the way to start a ball game. Talk about a punch to the gut right at the first bell. I drive deep left field. Peralta is not even going to move as that ball is gone. Tatis, second deck. Home run in each of the three games of this series. Home run number eight of the year. Fernando Tatis Jr. Get to know that name. It's 5 nothing Padres. I get it. Instead, trailing by a run now, two down in the ninth. 
And Tatis sends it to left field. Hilliard going back at the wall. It is gone. A home run to tie the score for Fernando Tatis Jr. With two outs in the ninth, Tatis takes it out of the yard at Coors. And the Padres have tied it up. Fastball, middle in, and he knew he got it. Cuidado, Fernando. Wow. You got a hitter's count, two and one. Turned around the four seam fastball. Oh, what a great effort also by Sam Hilliard. I mean, you know, he went up and over out of his reach, and just like that, we are tied. Weaver set at the belt, now the pitch. Swinging a hard hit liner through the left side for a base hit. Ahmed Dole couldn't get there. Garcia comes in to score. Mejia is being waved as it found its way all the way to the wall. And right behind him, Olivares. Tatis into third with a bases clearing triple. And just like that, the Padres have come all the way back and take a 6-2 lead. It was a sharply hit liner towards short. But because of where Peralta, the left fielder, and Starling Marte, the center fielder, were playing, it managed to find its way all the way to the fence. On the ground and by the first baseman, Rios down to the right field corner. Mejia racing around. They may try and score him. They will throw coming playward, and Mejia will be safe at the plate. And the Padres strike first on top, one to nothing. To third goes Tatis. Mejia scores all the way from first with two down, and the Padres strike first. Great piece of hit by Fernando. Foot is down. He's got the pitch eyeing it. Just drive it that way. Take it down that first baseline. Now everybody's off and running. Glenn Hoffman, you have to send him here. With the stuff that May has tonight, you don't know how many opportunities you're going to get. He's got the green light. Barnes was in the baseline. That's fair game. And Mejia knocks him down. Ball is loose, and that's a run for San Diego. Tatis sends one of the air to right field. Peterson going back at the wall. That ball will carry out of here. Fernando Tatis Jr. ties the game three to three. Opposite field, his third home run of the season for Tatis Jr. Three solo home runs for the Padres, and Tatis ties it up against Walker Bueller. Oh, there was something in the air that night. The star's so bright. Fernando goes opposite field with the curveball. We saw the curveball to Profar for the strikeout. Here's the 3-1. Fernando hits it in the air the other way towards the right field corner. Long run. Davis going back, looking up, and this one is gone. Another three-run homer. This one belongs to Fernando Tatis Jr., his first dinger of the season, and the Padres jump in front three to one here in the third. Opposite field over the landing in right. Wow. And a three-run triple in yesterday's game, and a three-run homer tonight in San Francisco. Wind is blowing out to right. It helps it, no question about that. A hanging breaking ball from Samarja. And Fernando waited just an extra, extra sp split part of a second and that was the difference. 